Nothing but trouble, huh? I understand. Oh, so, yeah, they're not allowed to search by his bail pay paperwork? So he's beyond curfew, and they're using that as a right to search. Uh, I, he appeared uh, uh, combative and stuff. Pretty good. Certainly sounds like he's crying for help, but he looked like in physical, good physical shape, so just really mad. Yeah, I believe you're right, Christopher. Um, uh, 
he violated his bail conditions by uh, being beyond curfew. I don't know how the details of that work. I really don't. He's certainly aggravated enough to uh, have some kind of issue, whether it's 1044 or what have you. Yeah. As people were complaining about, you know, oh yeah, he's, I can hear him screaming in the police car. Uh, he, he's asking for help, but, uh, you know, again, if he's, he's vocalizing that much, he don't need any help. So his, his obvious mistake was getting in trouble in the first place. Uh, once these people have their teeth into you, uh, you got nothing left, you know. And the vehicle is, uh, as you can see, that he's got a tag hanging. He's got issues with bumpers. Uh, I don't see a whole lot of tread on the tires. Uh, there's multiple reasons to. Uh, he's really getting vocal now. Uh Man. Have a nice trip to the police station, I'll tell you that. Holy smokes. Copy, you need a record? I got a triple check, but I'm pretty sure it's going to be no bail and he's out of control. I'm going to head south, but that's fine. 10 for it's perfectly fine. I probably got earplugs in the truck. <laughs> All right, so I think he's going to transport him directly uh, to county. Uh, he is losing it in the truck. Go ahead. First seven, if you'd like, you can take 14 with you. Yeah, I'll be all set. Copy. Yeah, there's a ton of issues with this. Uh, the ride you don't want to take. All right, we're going to head on out. Uh, he's just waiting for the wrecker. I didn't see him gather any evidence, so uh, this is all about the bail conditions, I believe. All right, we're going to head on out, guys. Uh,